How's it going, Z fam? We are back in the realm of Breath of the Wild, and we're in another maze. <laughs> Alright, well that just happened. I kind of want to go left here, but it doesn't look like I can, so it looks like we're going to have to always follow the right wall. Let's go ahead and use our wow, durability. Whew. Whew. Whee. Let's use this bow. All right, so we're going to follow the right wall through this entire maze. Thank you so much, guys, for watching the series, for sticking through with me. Even though I'm, I'm inept and stupid and dumb when it comes to a lot of different things, I'm glad y'all are having fun, as much fun as I am, potentially, in this long journey through time. Oh, no, this is the wrong game. Wrong game. But I can climb. What? So I could have just climbed over that plague. Can I just climb to the middle? No, we're not going to do that. We're not going to do that. We're going to walk all the way through the maze. Sorry if you guys hear some music in the background, by the way. I don't think you'll be able to, because I have a pretty good settings on the old microphone. But if you do, uh, one of my roommates is playing some some tunes. Some tunes. Man, this is actually like a... This, this maze has a lot more dead ends. Oh, look at that. Really random. Um, yeah, so finally I'm over my sickness like entirely. I feel pretty fantastic. If not, well, no, I feel pretty refreshed, honestly. Might do, might do a stream or something. I don't know. We'll see. I'm kind of just enjoying doing uh, episodic YouTube stuff. It seems like more my jam. It's more chill. It's more. Uh, I, don't, I don't know if it's necessarily more chill. It's just more my jam right now at this moment. Every now and again, I get the itch to stream, which is kind of cool that I have the YouTube and like the YouTube is doing my videos and my streaming. So it's all going to the same thing instead of uh, kind of want to go that way. But but stairs. Ah, good thing I did. But stairs. <laughs> oh, it's just five ice arrows. Oh, that reminds me. We got to do our we got to do our amiibo check. Amiibo check, quick, quick, everybody, while we're while we're here. That one, you know, I'm just gonna open this one immediately. Let's see what we got. Come on, come on. Oh, God, I'm so unlucky. I'm so unlucky when it's coming to this crap. All right, let's try the uh, other one real quick. It's just not. It doesn't. It doesn't. It's not happy. I think it's been used way too many times because it is my brother's. Oh. Real parts with long throw. I don't care about that crap. Do I not care about that crap? No, I don't care about that crap. I got so many good weapons. Man. Uh, we're not going to go that way. We're going to go this way. Because we're following the always follow the right wall rule. And that's how we will find most of the things in the maze. As well as, you know, others. I feel like there's going to be a lot of dead ends. I don't know what's going on. Anyway, a couple of y'all commented uh, that you were surprised in that one shrine that I did. That it only took one cube instead of two. Yeah. Always got to think of the easy way out, you know? That's that's the zum way. Easy way out. Am I right, guys? <laughs> what the? Hey, nice, nice try, buddy. You know what? He's a red one. I'm glad I can just kill them. I don't have to necessarily worry about, like, avoiding them. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, what's this? What the... What the... Arrows and flint. I mean, I gotta, right? Oh, no, I'm not doing it with this thing. Very interesting. I still have yet to break the Master Sword. That's the insane part of this whole. Oh, a shield. A hunter's shield. Nice. Let's use that bad boy. Oh, these arrows. Are you serious? Another meteor rod? I feel like I'm going to keep mine. What's all these arrows? Oh. 
Oh, silver boy. No, my hunter shield. How dare you? me really Dang. Oh, I'm not full health anymore So it just breaks his body. <laughs> what a guy. Oh man, I haven't bought one of them yet. Nice, we got some sparkly shields. Sparkly sparkly boomerang. I feel like I have to pick that up, right? Yeah, that's that's enough. Is this guy for real? Now what's this boomerang? Durability up, huh? Always fun. Always fun. Always fun. Edge of duality? A curious double-edged sword crafted used the Sheikah technologies originally made for Highland Knights unfamiliar with single-edged blades. That's 50 damage. Dude, what an interesting sword. I'm finding like new swords and stuff. This is actually really cool. Um Man. This is kind of ridiculous. <laughs> uh... Alright, I guess we'll take that. It's just... Everything's like massive durability too. It's because I keep using the Master Sword. I want to use it until it breaks! God dang it! I want to use it until it breaks! It's gonna break soon. I believe it. It's gonna break soon, and then we're gonna go back to using regular weapons. Because they're almost as good as a Master Sword. Holy crap, it's insane. Got a spear there. Some more arrows, nice. So I don't remember if I mentioned, yeah, comments. Uh, so a couple of you guys, I think Lucian and, uh, yeah, the, the two cubes thing, I told you about that. Oh, what a dodge. And uh, a lot of you were surprised. I think also Fuzzy and Lucian were also were surprised about uh, <laughs> getting the star drop from the flipping dog. That was so awesome. I can't believe I did that. We're gonna we're gonna hopefully we're gonna always give the dogs like the best meat now whenever we see a new dog because my goodness we want the best of loots. So we're gonna give the dog the best of foods. Uh, uh, am I right? Am I right? All right. We're, we're, we're gonna, we're gonna finish this maze up real quick. Nothing. It's weird, like, sun glare. Got another chest. I think this is the last chest in here, and then we can just go to the middle. Nice, silver ruby. That's actually kind of what I need. So, I think I can actually just go this way. We're not doing the right trick. But I think if I do this, I can just go to the middle, potentially. Maybe not. Maybe I maybe I maybe I screwed myself up by doing this. Actually, I think I think I need to go back to the uh, where I was. I think that's the, that's what I need to do. I need to go back over here. And uh, so this maze is actually very easy if you just look at the map. You can kind of see exactly where to go. It's not, it's not too hard, to be honest, but, um, but, um, yeah. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back to where I was. You can't get in there. So no, I do actually have to go all the way around. So I was doing the right thing. Wow. I thought that they wanted me to only go halfway through the maze, but no, this maze is actually, like, 
they want you to go all the way through the entire maze. Okay, cool. I actually like that. I like that better. I think this is going to be one of the last mazes we ever do, unless there's one at Hyrule Castle as well. A lot of mazes in this game. It's kind of interesting. They should have a maze with, like, really... The Rook's protection is now ready to roll. Oh, yeah. We're ready to roll. I think, uh... Kind of skipping any little. Hopefully, there's no like Easter eggs or anything. Oh, dude, that scared the crap out of me. I'm not gonna lie. You scared the absolute bejesus out of me. Holy cow! That was intense. Holy cow! This game still scares me every now and again. Oh man, I bet a couple of you. Can't wait for me to place through Subnautica Sub Zero whenever that actually comes out all the way. Because that game, the first one scared the hell out of me when I played through it. <laughs> that was a great series of videos. So, that was all live streamed as well. Those were all live streamed and ripped from the Twitch stream and brought to here. I found him. Big ol' eyeball. I could have just climbed over this. Seems... Seems strange, man. I literally could have just climbed over it and shot it. But... We didn't get all the treasure... That we got. Oh, yeah! Like that. That's what I'm talking about right there. Mmm! Gimme that. Nah. Wait, what? They want me to come in from the top? Shouldn't it be like right here? So this maze is actually very easy if you just look at the map. You can kind of see exactly where to go. Bruh. Do they want me to come in from the top? So that would be insane. I don't know why I didn't use my blast of my Falco's Gale to get up here, but... I'm literally tapping my feet to the sound of Link doing the tap, 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 tap. It's like I'm climbing. Climb along with me, right? <laughs> Dude, I stopped following my right wall thing. No, it's right here. What the heck? So they did only want you to go halfway through it. Or no. It's just a secret knight's bow. Can I grab onto the wall? Oh, there we go. What? A strange maze. So this maze is actually very easy if you just look at the map. You can kind of see exactly where to go. But wait, if I followed the right wall all the way through just brought me to there, then now I'm in... So oh, another chest. The explorers get a lot. Oh, a diamond. Sick. It's always good to explore. Remember that, guys. So... We killed it. But there's no entry. It just leads us. If we would have always followed the right wall, we would have gotten. Oh my god, it's a masterful maze. So this maze is actually very easy if you just look at the map. You can kind of see exactly where to go. Dude, I wonder if there was like a switch that I missed. Oh, is this whole episode going to be dedicated to this maze? Tune in this episode to find out. I hear something like moving around over there. I 
See, now I'm not doing it right. I'm doing, I'm just wandering kind of randomly through the maze. Not really randomly. I'm looking for the source of that weird noise. So this maze is kind of following the map, but at the same time. How is that hole not a thing? Oh, Link. It's like this little bonus area right here. Oh, there's more. Oh my god, are you kidding me? You actually made it all the way over here, you're a god. Let go. What? You jumped! So it's a 3D maze. So always following the right wall doesn't necessarily work. Oh my gosh, we're finding loads of treasure though. Holy crap. Hey, we found a royal shield. Look at that. Boom, 60, 60 defense. Oh, it looks so sick. Oh, it looks so sick. I feel like I want to save it. <laughs> I think I, is this the entrance? Did I solve it? Okay, I think I solved it. What a strange maze. Oh, there's an exit right there. So they want you to be able to climb on purpose. That's not like a make it easier thing. That's a make it harder thing. Holy crap, look at this. My, me and my eagle eye. Giving us loads of the loot. Bro, this maze is sick. This was one of the better mazes, because it was like 3D, it was a little bit more difficult. Sick. Yeah. So it was guarded by a Lionel too, so yeah, this is, uh, this is definitely one of the better mazes. We made it. We made it, boy. We made it. Look at me not healing up either so I can get healed up by the shrine. That's called efficiency. That's called efficiency. If you're in a hurry, you can use X. Guys, you know that? X actually makes you go faster. In general. Just always. What did I win? Please be a piece of armor. Hey, hey! That's what we wanted. We got the full barbarian armor now. Hey! Also, someone said you can sort this by set. Oh, you can. So there's two different sorts. There's by set. Oh, that's so much better. Okay, sick. I didn't know there was two different types of sorting. That's sick. That's sick. I think that was Bounty Hunter that said that, but I could be wrong. Sorry, guys. There's been a, there's been a lot of comments, so it's harder to put the comments in the video. But I'm still reading them. I'm still using them. And it's, uh, it's fantastic. And you know what I want to do after what I'm doing right here? Which I think this is the last thing that I, that I wanted to do up here in the top left of the map. At least. Sorry, that music. You guys can't hear it, but I can. Maybe you can hear it when I talk. It's loud. Anyway. <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't copyright strike me. We did it! So what I want to do... I think this was the last thing in this area. Got a Lionel right there and a Lionel right here. Yeah, it is. There's a gem up there for that tree that we need to do. We are actually going to start this side quest in Ateno, right here, that you guys wanted me to do a long time ago. Nova and other people all wanted me to do this. So, 
We're gonna start it. We're gonna start it. This episode. That's what I'm talking about right there. Some ingredients will freeze if submerged in ice cold water or when left out in frigid regions. That's what happened to that meat. I noticed that when I was editing, it wasn't uh, frozen meat. When I, uh, I, you gotta pick it up quick, otherwise it turns into frozen meat. I think it's the same thing with uh, you get cooked meat in the lava area or whatever. It's pretty cool. Yo, we gotta upgrade these. That's already level three. We gotta upgrade those. Oh my gosh, I look like a. Yeah, I don't really like the look of the armor, but man, it's uh, it's pretty sick. So, shrine, and then it was the bridge to the left over here. What are these weird-looking houses? Look like Minecraft houses almost. Look at that. It's like a Minecraft house. Hello. Hello. This is like what Nova's house would look like in Minecraft. I'm just gonna assume they're all empty, but I wanna check anyway. Alright. So here's the bridge. And I missed this. Hey, check it out, a rock. Yo, this guy's got a sledgehammer. Yeah. Hey, evening there. Another day, another ruby. What you doing? Booking, as you can see. I mean, it looks like you're just hitting that corner with a sledgehammer. It doesn't really look like work, but you know what I mean. Just, uh, sure, keep going. This old house here has been abandoned. Everyone in Ateno agreed we should demolish it. The old owner apparently went off to the castle to report for service. Never came back, never wrote. So away it goes. Uh, I buy this place? I guess he is working then. I mean, why would you start with the corner of the... As a construction worker. <laughs> it's not how you do it. I guess I'd buy the place? Well, I'm not really into real estate, so I can't really help you out there. If you're really interested in the place, you're gonna need to talk to a boss. So, uh... Hard work then? <laughs> yep. And I wouldn't want to know the other way, to be honest with you. So I gotta talk to the boss? Wait, I can buy this place? <gasps> Wait! This is the house! I recognize this. From way back when we played Minecraft. This is the house that frickin' Nova made. I don't remember this part, though. Let go. Oh, hey, who are you? Hi. Evening. Are you a... Are you a... Are you... Are you... What are you doing? <laughs> In case it's not obvious, I'm demolishing a vacant house. Times are rough. Not a lot of buyers, you know. So the villagers... <laughs> I gave him this voice, I know. So the villagers decided it was best to just tear it down. Uh, I can buy it. Hmm. Whoa. Get a load of young money bags. He just wants to buy it, huh? Okie do. Let me lay it out for you. See, the house been vacant for years. So the villagers had a meeting, argued, voted, and decided to tear it down. The demolition cost with a so fifty thousand rubies. Holy crap! We need more money. Mm -hmm. So when you say you want to buy it, we're talking about fifty grand. You sure you got that much on you? Yeah, I'll pay. Oh. Well. Who would have thought? Little go-getter, aren't you? <laughs> reminds me of me back in the day. It's kind of German. Mm -hmm. All right, all right, look. Here's the deal, just for you. I'll cut you a special price of the... Wait! <laughs> We're... <laughs> Wait. <laughs> I'm not sure if this... If you... Uh, what was your name? Bolson? Bolson. Okay, it's nice to meet you, Bolson. I like your voice. I like your collar, too. Um, but I don't know if you know how haggling works. <laughs> First of all, I'm the one who's supposed to say the lower price. Second of all, 3,000 is like... <laughs> That's like, <laughs> what is that? That's literally like, what is that? One, two, three, one, two, three, That's one, two, three, four, five. That's 6% of 50 grand. 
But in return, I'm going to need you bring 30 woody bottles. So for... Th wood. 30 wood is worth 47,000 rubies. This is like RuneScape. These are some U logs right here. They're magic logs. That's a construction joke. I missed the joke. Sorry. Hi. Oh my god, what a face. Hudson, Carson, stop what you're doing. Hi. You got it. Freaking Mario over here. So how much wood do I got? 3,000 and some wood. I mean, yeah, that's quite a bit easier. We got 23. We're already, like, right close there. <laughs> Let me talk to Mario from Kakariko. Oi. What you doing? I'm off in my usual night spot. By the way, it should be Mario, actually. Are you going to buy the house? That is not Mario. Holy crap, what am I doing? Yeah. <laughs> Mamma mia, you're pretty studly, aren't you? Actually, it is kind of. You're great hire for our company. What is your name? I'm Link. Oh, well, too bad, can't hire you. Why? Because your name doesn't end in son. son? <laughs> the boss, Paulson, has a strict hiring rule. Need the name ending in son. No exceptions. Oh, you're Hudson. Building? Builds team unity, he says. Anyway. You seem to some stuff. Okay. Well, time to go get some wood. I mean, I already got 23. Shouldn't be too hard. So I get to buy a house. Man, that's pretty sick. At least it's not one of these houses. My god. That's really funny that I mentioned Nova and Minecraft, and then that's actually the thing that he built. That's the one thing he built in the Minecraft series that we did, was that house. That's really funny. Shopkeep! Give me arrows. We need to kill some guardians and stuff. Maybe we'll do some grinding episodes where we'll... What? Can I get wooden bundles just by doing that? I don't actually know. I think I mostly get them at stables. Oh, a quest! I haven't done the quests in Kakariko. Night or day, doesn't matter. Gotta check everyone out. Ever stayed at the Tompu Inn? Nope. If you're not staying there, then... You're supposed to check out everyone who comes into town. Sounds, uh, weird. Uh, Your job is weird. Whatever it is you do. Uh, I know things have been peaceful recently, but outside world is still pretty dangerous, yeah. So I gotta check, make sure any beauties, uh, I mean, uh, suspicious folk come around here. Beauties? <sighs> if you're lucky enough to stay at the Trompu Inn, you'll see what I mean. Say hello to Prima for me if you do. Not even that she knows who I am. This is tough. You have to give us something. What kind of gift do you think this won't? Just take a guess. It's not for me. You understand. It's for my boy's friend. Alright, so we gotta we gotta be this dude's uh, wingman. I remember Prima. Isn't she the one who like hides in the corner all creepily? That guy seems kind of like angry for someone like her. Where's the inn? Normally it's the big building with the... Uh... That's either the mayor's house or the inn. Okay, that's definitely not it. I'm gonna chop your tree down, though. Oh, the prayer statue! Give me a hot canister. Or container. Wonder if I got enough time to be this dude's wingman before we end this episode. I gotta find the inn really fast. I do. Hey, we are on our second row now, guys. We're overpowered. All right, where's the inn? Ah, it's this building. That was my second guess. All right, Prima. Are you the creepy one in the corner? Or are you Prima? Oh, you're Prima. Oh, yeah. She is cute. Regular bed is 20 rupees, so if you want a more relaxing, you can have an extra soft bed for 40. Uh, yeah, I'll have a soft bed. <laughs> Morning. Please enjoy your stay. She reminds me of the chick from uh, Lon Lon Ranch. <laughs> Guys, we're at the 30 minute mark. That means we're gonna have to be this dude's wingman at the start of the next episode. We're probably also just gonna hit up some stables to get some uh, 
some uh, some stuff. You know what I'm saying? Some. Uh... I bet she wants lawn lawn milk, dude. That's my bet. She wants lawn lawn milk. Do I have to go up and read her diary? Ooh, this might be a good quest, guys. So I'm gonna see you guys. God, I look stupid, but this armor is sick. In terms of it's, uh, I just like doing extra damage. So we'll see you in the next episode, everyone. Have a great day. Peace out, ski fam. All right, we're chopping down Hyrule Forest. Wait. Oh my god, it's that easy. What? All I gotta do is chop these up?